there were a couple of questions regarding the the cucumber um, framework, and I think that's that's one of the topics that uh, also needs some <laughs> some some opinion from you, Gleb. Let's uh, let's hear it. <laughs> okay. Pros and cons. Go ahead. I love <laughs> I love three things in this life: mana repos, page objects, and cucumber. <laughs> and the thing that I like or love about all three is that I never have to use them. Right? <laughs> all right. Okay. Um, so my personal opinion, right? You, you can throw it away, ignore me completely, right? Um, is that I've never seen a cucumber test written where it doesn't become an obstacle to you understanding what's happening, right? And especially when we hired at Mercari, we would interview people and we would say, okay, write any type of tests, come back, show it to us. We'll ask questions, right? And what we would do, let's say you're writing tests for, to do MVC. You pick, to, like, we don't pick a project for you. You pick whatever best showcases your uh, skills. Every candidate who came with cucumber syntax, right? Like, you know, all these events, you know, so on. We usually then would ask every candidate to change the test a little bit, right? Imagine, oh, you're checking three objects, uh, check two and then add, a, 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 you know, a check for let's say, some classes present in the middle one, like completed. So we would ask that every candidate who came with this cucumber abstraction on top of a test commands was struggling, right? Mm -hmm. They're like, oh, wait, I now have to use something that doesn't really match cleanly into the cucumber syntax. So I have to modify code here and here and this step there. And they just like, it, it, the complexity becomes overwhelming. Mm -hmm. If you use standard commands, right? You're like, oh yeah, sh should have class completed. Like you literally add one more thing like in, in your spec. It was such a, weird experience where like oh yeah cucumber is just another way to write tests but it becomes this layer that becomes a project of its own yeah the same opinion kind of applies to page objects right mm -hmm. and i promise i actually found a very good example of page object in cypress where i think it doesn't help i will write a blog post too all right, right? so it's not going to be how to do it i just going to be like I think if you're doing this, you probably want to rethink this, 